It's about getting them back to the site, right? Mm -hmm. uh, you just, you're interested. It's almost like a form of content marketing, right? And just getting them back, so giving them value. You already have the audience, leverage that audience. And so what we're talking about here is, is maybe making a couple dollars off the drop ship. Maybe it's really slim margins, which it typically is, but it's getting them back and getting them into the routine of trusting you more and more and building that brand past your product more into a lifestyle brand. And then along the way, you, you can insert some of your new products or products they haven't bought yet. And really what we're talking about is lowering customer acquisition costs and increasing customer lifetime value, right? It's just a different way of doing that. Yeah, and, and it makes sense because, you know, the most one of the most expensive things you can do is generate a new customer, right? And that, that's where we, as an agency at the OMG Commerce, focus, you know, YouTube, Google Ads, uh, Amazon Ads, Amazon DSP, things like that. But man, once you get a customer, if you can then sell them instead of on average twice a year, you can sell them three or four or five or six times a year and get them to come back. It creates more loyalty, creates more profits, and then you can be more aggressive on the, on the front end. So it makes a lot of sense. And, and I love the idea of launching new products. I think the, you know, the brands that really scale and um, you know, become valuable and have big exits, you know, they, they've got a product launch model and formula. But it's yeah. still pretty slow, right? How often can you launch new products? And so this is a great way to, to supplement, I think, and really, really tie into, really accelerate that growth, get more from each customer.